New at five students have taken a TikTok challenge to a criminal level. They're uploading videos of themselves damaging school property or stealing items altogether. Julia Fellow spoke to police who have had enough. Friday night football, a favorite pastime in Wisconsin, turned into a headache when families at Cedarburg High School tried to use the restroom. I got a message from a custodian that the soap bags are missing and they're shoved in, you know, in the toilets. Cedarburg Police School Resource Officer Casey Ward says it is all part of the viral TikTok trend called devious licks. You see them entering the women's bathroom, uh, coming out chuckling. You see them entering the men's bathroom, coming out chuckling. Officer Ward says about eight to ten students were involved. All of them are middle schoolers. We're in the process of figuring out what we're going to do by speaking with them and getting parents involved. Because they could face serious consequences. Um, which leads to kids having to pay restitution. Um, so the, the price of the damages, they could have to do um, community service time to make up for that. They're not able to pay for it. Uh, this could go on your record. We reached out to TikTok asking how they plan to deal with this illegal trend and have not heard back. But if you search the hashtag causing this havoc, it's now blocked. Over in Waukesha, Captain Dan Bauman says several middle school and high schoolers have been caught videotaping themselves. I think it's very stupid. It's ignorant and it's, it's unwanted. It's unnecessary. Ultimately, this comes down to the taxpayers uh, having to pay the, the bill on this. We're going to discuss that. Maybe we should blast out an email sometime today or later on this week. To parents, this is a great opportunity for you to be that mom and that dad and to, and to talk to your kids. The damage here at Waukesha schools has graduated from stealing soap to ripping out faucets and even toilets from the walls. Some of the damage could cost thousands of dollars to fix. Reporting Julia Fellow, TMJ4 News. And Waukesha police say they are working with school leaders to figure out disciplinary action. There are at least six school districts in our area that have reported this tick tock trouble.